You're here. All I contacted more than one person. Secondly, she came here as Jean herself, not as the acting Grandmaster. A Jean you would never see, even as an honorary knight. What a surprise. I heard about the Holy Liar, but I never suspected it was you. So, the sound of the Holy Liar can purify Storm Terror and return it to normal? Is that true? That's right! Your honorary knight is putting themselves on the front line to try and resolve this Storm Terror issue. Now that's the hot shot of the Knights of Favonius I'm talking about. Feels like we're breaking the law, though. I understand this kind of absurd explanation is hard to believe. But we can ask the Bard to play the song again to try and persuade... I believe you. To persuade our stubborn command... Wait, what? I can't think of any reason for Devalin's betrayal, given it was once one of the Four Winds. However, if it was poisoned in the battle over Mondstadt all those years ago, and then corrupted by the Abyss Mage after it woke up, we can't really blame it. But as Acting Grandmaster, I obviously cannot make such a statement publicly. Diplomatic pressure from the Fatui makes it hard for us to seek a peaceful resolution to the Storm Terror issue. People would think I've lost grip on the gravity of the situation. That's why I can only do this in private. <laughs> That's one of the reasons I don't like the Knights of Favonius. What surprises me is that you would believe in Outlander so easily. My cautious and meticulous superior, even you trust him, don't you, sir? <sighs> I already told you not to call me sir. Never mind. We don't often get to work together after all. idea of where the holy liar de Hamel is nice recovery she's really talented at changing the subject the conflict between Mondstadt and Shneznaya stems from the conflict between the seven nations and their respective gods the cryo gods Fatui seem to be after the animal gods power uh... Favonius publicly prevented an attempt on Duvalin's head, then the only other way to affect the animal god's power is to take the Holy Liar. The number of Fatui that have come to Mondstadt is far from limited. I've already managed to coerce a few reports out of them. Diluc has determined that the Holy Liar is not being held in the Goth Grand Hotel. I imagine they don't want to leave something stolen in a place where it could be so easily found. Too much of a scene gets made, then it becomes a big diplomatic issue. <laughs> Such is the diplomacy between the seven nations. Outlander, ready to go? Jean just said the Fatui are trying to take Devalin's power for the Cryo God. I fear this might. I think they intend to use connection to the like Lisa traced the source of the storm to the temples. The god of animal? 
Hasn't been seen for more than a thousand years. What makes you think that's their intention? Oh. Uh. Uh. uh huh? Forget it. I don't like having to pry. Here, take this. What is it? A disguise to protect your identity. Put it on before you run into the Fatui. Unfortunately, they're still one of Mondstadt's allies. At least that's the facade we're maintaining. Our actions are going to get them stirred up. Better to not implicate yourself on a personal level. Floor's defenses have been broken. I thought it was the Abyss Order attacking. How did you guys know the liars here? The place is being kept is locked up tight. If you're after the key, keep going further into the ruins, but don't come after me. I don't know which one of the guards has it, but I'm sure you can find the guards and find out for yourselves. This guy looks like he's about to wet himself. You, you just worry about yourselves. One of the Eleven is already in Mondstadt. Signora, when she gets her hands on you, she's gonna string you up and torture you. When that time comes, don't you dare say a word about me. Did he say Signora? What a strange name. Number eight of the Eleven goes by the name Signora. The fact that the Fatui can run amok across the Seven Nations like they do is entirely because of the Eleven. We need to act quickly before she gets wind of what's going on.
What are you doing here? Did you already beat all the other guards? What? I'm not scared of you. A debt collector will come to my aid. Not like I have a choice anyway. All right, you're free to go. But I don't have the key, unfortunately. You'll have to ask the next guard you come across. He says the key isn't here. Shall we try another room? How'd you get in here? Ha! <laughs> like hell. <sighs> the will of Shneznaya is as solid as the permafrost. I will not yield.
you rats scurry out from. Senora's not going to tolerate this kind of interference in our affairs. So I'll be the one to take care of you. Save her the trouble of having to deal with you herself. You're in for a little shot. The liar is back in safe hands! Where did that guy go, though? He was here a second ago. Senora is going to end you. The songs bards sing of your demise will be so terrifying. The people of Mondstadt will never sleep again for the nightmares they give them. Big talk for a guy who still ran off in the end. Chicken. Welcome back! Oh, this is the Holy Liar! You managed to retrieve it! The pattern of flowing wind carved on the rosewood, and the strings still feel cool to the touch, too! Oh, the memories. What do you think, Venti? Can you summon Devalin? Mm, although this liar is the real thing, I doubt that it's going to work. As you can see, the liar has been through a thousand years of history. Its animal power has run dry. In this condition, you couldn't play music fit for even Diluc's tavern with it. Bards fight to get on the stage of my tavern. Don't make assumptions. Is that really important right now, Master Diluc? And you! Did you just borrow the holy liar to play music for drunkards to hear? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Anyway, we won't be able to call Devalin with it. The lyre itself is fine, but the strings... Relax, it's not broken. It's just that the intensity of its animal power has greatly diminished. Do you still have Devalin's teardrop crystal with you? Great! Try to use it on the holy lyre. Worked as expected. This youthful glow. Praising yourself? Really? I was talking about the Holy Liar. Thanks to our traveler friend having purified the crystal, the Holy Liar won't continue to lose power. That said, its power is far from replenished. It'd be great if we could get more tears. 
I can surmise that Devalin will already be crying. Suffering alone in some deserted place. <sighs> Devalin. Poor baby. This is not something that an honorary knight can accomplish alone. I will mobilize the rest of the knights to assist. When you get the teardrop crystal, please let our honorary knight perform the purification process. Heroes supporting each other and setting out on a journey together. How exciting! Let me come up with a song for you. Is that all you're going to do? Just sing? Hmm, wouldn't be much of a bard if I didn't, now would I? Huh, <laughs> you're so cheeky. You deserve an ugly nickname. Oh, Paimon knows. From now on, you'll be known as Tone Deaf Bard. This search reminds me of a few had with Six months ago, a thief stole treasure from the East Temple of the Four Winds. Whoa, what was it? A cup used by Barbados? No. Although, if such a thing existed, it would be very valuable. Among all the relics they managed to dig up, one particular object was very rare. It was a vial which contained the Animo God's breath. Relics come in every shape and form, huh? Anyone with an eye for fine art would like to add this relic to their collection. Once word got out, the Fatui started trying to seek it out as well. They've made tons of counterfeits that can be found everywhere. In response, I just bought everyone I could find, irrespective of its authenticity. We're still at it now. I've bought more than 2,000 fakes to date, and the Fatui are yet to find the real one. Whoa, you guys are insane. So it means the real one must be out there somewhere on the black market, right? Hmm. Paimon will give you a discount on them if she finds any, because Paimon's just great like that. Sure, you can try to find the real one. Like? I'll take what you find, even if they're fake. Once you're done, find me at the winery. I'll trade you a beer for every 20 you find.
wonder and I'll be gentle. Dodge this! Boy. Hey, go, go, Barrett! You're in for a little shock. <laughs> You're in for a little shock. This one will be frozen in time. Be gone! Reward on the road. Hyman didn't think we'd find the volunteers in a place like this. As knights, we are taught to hone our investigative skills. Wow! Very impressive. In my experience, the secret to finding what you are looking for is to never look for it in the first place. Don't think too much about it and don't search too hard. And before you know it, what you're looking for will appear right before your very eyes. What? <laughs> Don't worry about it too much. The more flustered you become, the less likely you are to find it. Pay attention to what you see in your peripheral vision and you might just stumble upon what you're looking for. I don't know. It doesn't sound like that would work. No, seriously, it does though. In fact, it's how I used to find my tortoise whenever he went missing. Wait, you had a pet tortoise? Yes, why? Something wrong, Paimon? No, it's, uh, well, just surprising is all. <laughs> don't. I had one too when I was a kid. What's so strange about it? What? You too?
I'll keep this close. Come a little closer. I'll keep this close.
Come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. Freeze! You can't keep up with me!
Come a little closer. Freeze! This will be frozen in time. Come a little closer. Come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. Too early to relax. We're still not done with Storm Terror. Besides, the Vatui could also be planning something. Hey, Diluc, I recently you persona non grata. <laughs> what an honor. Nobody was ever proclaimed persona grata by the. Fatui, the diplomatic delegation from Shneznaya? What have they got against Master Dilu? The Fatui are a problem not only for the Knights, they also present a real threat to the whole of Mondstadt. And when it comes to threats against Mondstadt, Dilu is... <sighs> That's enough, Jean. You Knights are subject to too many restrictions. You can't directly confront this so-called diplomatic scum. Personally, I despise them. If I were to choose between eating a cryo slime alive or joining the Fatui, I'd prefer to be crushed to death by a meteorite. Jeez, your wording is so very dramatic. <laughs> Keep this close. Woohoo! Protection Squad, assemble! Let's put our crystals together. These crystals look muddy. <sighs> Devalin, you're going through so much pain. Let's start purifying these crystals first. Please, Traveler. It is hard to believe such a thing is possible until you've seen it with your own eyes. Interesting. It's like filtering wine. The process is refreshing. 
I think we should have enough tears now. We crystals on the holy lyre like last time. It worked. It seems completely different from before. The liar's animal power seems fully restored. We should be able to use it now. It's all thanks to you. Now, where should we summon Storm Terror? It must be away from the city, else there will be casualties should we fail. Perhaps here at the winery? If the winery was destroyed, it's not something I couldn't eventually fix. But I'd still rather not go through the hassle. blows at sea or in high places should be able to carry a bard's words far away. It's never going to work if the air is too dry or suffocating. Paimon understands sea or high places, right? Then the best location to play the lyre would be... If you go east from Starfell Lake, there are mountains south of the beach. Oh, you mean that beach you were snoring away on and Paimon had to wake you? If you head to where the cliff juts out, that place is known as Star Snatch Cliff. What do you think, Bard? Meets the requirements, no? Let me think. Star Snatch Cliff. All right, let's do it there. Very well. Then let's meet at Star Snatch Cliff when we're ready. Please don't be late. <laughs> yes, ma'am! Uh, sorry. I didn't mean to...
What's the hurry? Come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. Freeze! Reward on the road. Answer from this world? Everyone is finally here. What a view! Lovely for a fated reunion, isn't it? Well, we must be prepared for a fight. Regardless of the outcome, things finally seem to be taking a turn for the better. Mondstadt has really been going through so much recently. Huh. 
In the end, the solution to our problem was as simple as a traveler in a song. I suppose the Knights of Favonius may have played a part in it, too. Oh, we get it, Master D. Luke. Everyone, please step aside. I, the best wandering bard of the mortal world, shall begin my performance with the Holy Liar. in your eyes. Sadness that speaks of your yearning for this song. They are communicating. Barbe, Venti, please be careful. <laughs> You've known my true identity for some time now, haven't you, Jean? Though, I thank you for continuing to use the name Venti. How's the Holy Liar? Can it still be played, or does it need to be repaired? <sighs> Unfortunately, I think it's beyond repair. You're right. If we don't fight the evil at its source, then we can't save Devalin at all. In which case, I shall call upon Outrider Amber to track it down. No need. Why is that? I eradicated one not long ago, in one of the Four Winds temples. What? When? If you want to track those monsters down, then I'll seek answers from my contacts. I've got other means for getting the job done. Diluc. Though he dislikes the Knights of Favonius, he protects Mondstadt in his own way. Oh? Why does our little Paimon sound so doting all of a sudden? <laughs> Wait for my word. I'll be sure to let the Abyss Order know that their blatant disregard for Mondstadt will not go unpunished. Oh, <laughs> 